Welcome back. Thanks very much for staying with us. You're watching We On World is One with me, Raisha Segal. There's lots lot up on the show. But first, a quick check on the headlines. Rising signs of Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu isolated amid moves towards an Israel-Hamas ceasefire deal. There's pressure from within his own government as Yoav Gallant makes moves besides from the US and the Israeli people. Hundred and fifteen people now reported killed in the last week of clashes between demonstrating students and police in Bangladesh. Bangladesh military soldiers patrol the streets as curfew is imposed in multiple cities day after the worst violence in the country. Indian Army Chief General Upendra Devedi to visit Jammu today to chair a joint security review meeting with officers of the Border Security Force. Focus on a spate of recent terror incidents in the Jammu region and also infiltration of foreign terrorists. Most services hit by the global tech outage on Friday, recovering after several hours of disruptions. Cyber security firm CrowdStrike admits it could take some time before all systems are back up, though it has stressed that this was not a cyber attack. Billionaire Sultan Ibrahim Iskander officially installed as Malaysia's 17th king in a lavish ceremony showcasing the rich history of the Mali Sultanate. Ibrahim is king for a five-year term under a unique rotating monarchy system. <laughs> At least 11 killed, dozens reported missing in northwest China's Shaanxi province after bridge collapsed due to heavy rains and flash floods. 20 cars were reportedly washed away.